Hi guys, my name is Fungus Trooper and welcome back to Let's Play Wario. Just Wario, that's all. Um, oh, whoops, and I just went into the wrong level. That's a good start. Oh no, I didn't, because I need to get some treasure, don't I? Right, let's get some treasure, shall we? So I'm going to keep this hat for the whole level. That's the plan. Ah! There's <laughs> a bird nearly takes it away. Um, yeah, so I don't know what's going to happen this level. I don't know if I'll actually manage to beat the game. Um, I am quite... really? Crap, I can't actually remember if there's another... another hat. Well, at least I've learned that you can walk into the back of those and it doesn't hurt you. Um, there should be another hat, shouldn't there? Surely. Surely. Surely there'll be another hat. Um, what did I need the hat for exactly? Because I know that this one won't do. I think I needed to butt bash them. Oh, 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 whoops. Oh, now I've pressed the debug thing because I thought I was playing a PC game and I wasn't. Um, how do I get back to the world map? No way? Okay, fine. Fine. I'm going to run back to the world map, and you can't stop me unless, you know, there's no way to get back to the world map. In which case, I guess you can stop me. <laughs> Please be a way back to the world map. Ugh. What did I get hit by? I can't remember. I think it was just a bird, wasn't it? Or was it this guy? I would not be surprised if it was that particular guy. Particular. That's a good word. Right. Let's try that again. Hi guys, my name is Hunger Trooper, and well, <laughs> and so forth and so forth. Right. So this time, oh, you actually get a Viking hat straight away. That's handy. Was it that bird that hit me? No, it wasn't. Was it? Let's get some hearts. What is in here? Oh, a coin. Ah, maybe it was this guy that hit me. Or maybe it was that guy. Wow! Trick shot! Trick shot! Let's find out what's in here. Well, let's remember what's in here. Aha! Okay. So that that's not another hat. Whew. Right. So there's no more hats in that part of the game. <laughs> in that part of the level. Oh, shoots and ladders. <sighs> oh good. Why don't I just butt bunch them? <laughs> butt bunch them? That sounds bad. Let's not, let's not butt bunch anything. I don't even think that's a thing, but let's not do it. So what's in this one? Right, another of the same hats, but not if I get hit, because then I'll be a little Wario, and that's no good. Right, this was... no, I don't want to go in there, because if I get hit, I pretty much want to die. Oh god. Crap. Oh, okay. Fuck off. Bye, duck. Right, let's get some treasures. Hooray! Ooh. Right, it's better have been worth it. <laughs> okay. Bye, duck. Oh, good lord. Where am I? Ah, oh, this place is huge. Um. Ah, I need a bunny hood. Uh, I hope I wasn't already supposed to have the bunny hood. Okay. That's not a bunny hood. You can bugger off. Okay. Oh, no, that'll do. Actually. Why did I think I needed the bunny hood? 
Let me just find out what's up this way. I'm guessing the key? Okay, good. Phew, that was close. Well, I don't really know why I'm saying that was close, but it was! Oh. Well, that's good. Ah. Right, let's go pick up the key. Um, there you are. I like this part of the game. I wish that, like... Well, I was gonna say I wish more games had things like this, but I guess most modern games nowadays do. But still, I liked this when it was new. I can't remember if I ever got all of the treasures when I was a kid, though. Probably not, knowing me. <laughs> I was pretty impatient. <gasps> wow, I didn't even notice that is all of them. Gasps. Gasps abound. That's it. I've got all the treasures. Now I just need to beat Captain Syrup. King... King Syrup Face. It's not a good name. Um... What's a good name for the final boss of this game? Waluigi. There you go. I'll just, <laughs> I've decided no matter what it looks like, it's actually Waluigi in disguise. That sneaky Waluigi. Oops. Okie dokie. That'll do. That'll do. Oh, I've only actually just got enough coins to end this level. Hmm. <laughs> when I get nervous, fire shoots out of my nose. True story. Well, not really. Oh man, how the hell am I going to do this? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> what? How are you supposed to do that with fire hats? Ah, maybe you can't. Oh, I hope that's still... Oh, well, I guess we're going in here now. I hope... I really, really hope that that counted my treasure. Oh well, I guess we'll find out. If I've got to do this level again, then I've got to do this level again. <laughs> Look how slowly Wario falls. Oh, that's close. Oh, this is a terrifying area so far. Let's not do that. Oof. <laughs> this level is all kinds of dangerous. I don't like all these invisible blocks trying to kill me. I just know I'm going to hit my head on one of them soon. Okay, don't like not being able to see my character. Oh. Right, okay. Now we're inside. Okay. Wow, 62 coins, jeez. Well, that's just midway. Okay, this is terrifying. Oh wow, getting a hat when you already have a hat gives you 10 hearts. I did not know that. Well, you've learned something new here today. Well, I've learned something new here today. You probably knew that already if you've been watching these. Oh, okay. Just pick up a million random coins where I can't see them. That's fine. Okay. Don't like all the hats it's giving me. Really don't like all the hats it's giving me. Oh my good lord, what the hell are you? Oh, jeez, okay. Well, okay. <laughs> it turns around, dude! I got hit twice doing the same thing. Ah, <sighs> oh, I'm so stupid sometimes, I swear. I don't mean to be overly self-deprecating, but come on, that was the same thing twice, and I just stood there and got hit by it again. Right, I'm not going to lose this hat this time. This is it. Final boss hat. That's what this is. 
I guess, you know, Syrup Castle. Makes sense that there would be Syrup Knights. Aw oh, man, I've only got 62 coins that time. I guess I did just discover something quite important, and that is that if you are Little, uh, little Wario, at least you can um, throw a coin at things to hurt them. Seems pretty dangerous, though. Yes, we get the point. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'll just take these hats, then. Since they give you hearts, you know. Let's hear that lovely sound. Sounds like a pause noise. Okay, this is terrifying. Suitably terrifying. Oh. Wasn't too bad. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, good. I hate both of you. Oh, are you freaking kidding me? Come on in. Come on in. Oh, just come on. <laughs> that was stupid, but it worked. Go away. No one likes your style. Right, let's fight another knight, I'm guessing. Oh my god, god. Um, oh, it's Princess Syrup. <laughs> no, 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 says Princess Syrup. Okay, so now I'm fighting an evil genie. <gasps> I remember this! I did beat this as a kid! Oh, I can't remember how you fight it! <laughs> oh my good lord, okay. Oh, 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 okay, it was way too much stuff. Oh man, really? I've got to get all the way back there? I cannot honestly believe that it expects you to do all of this each time that you die in 10 seconds to that boss. Oh, come on. And we go back in silence. Maybe I can skip some of these. Because I know I'm going to be doing it an awful lot of times. Oh. Yes, okay, we get the point. Picking up a hat. Picking up a coin. Picking up another hat. Yes, okay. Now we get a suitably terrifying climbing puzzle. Oh, okay, can't do that. It's fine, didn't want to do that. God, the noise! The noise is what's terrifying. Why do fireballs make that noise? Right. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot I've got to do this, and I? Good. No survivors. <laughs> okay, you survive. Anyway, back in Genieville. Right, so his fireballs go across the floor. Oh, that's pause. Fireballs go across the floor. Fireballs go across the floor. Got it. I also need to figure out what the hell the actual um, lamp is for. Oh, maybe I charge it. Maybe that hurts him. Nice. Right, fireballs, go across the floor, got it. Right. Okay, fireballs, go across the floor, got it. Um, 
still don't understand what the fuck I'm doing. Okay, fireballs go across the floor either way. Okay, would like Lamp to do something, please. Why is it not landing side up? Which I'm pretty sure is what it has to do. Oh, there you go. Right, now what the hell does this little dude do? Nothing, he just dies. What the hell? Oh, okay. You have to jump on them. Never would have guessed that in a Wario game. Ooh, that was a bit scary and close. Okay, that didn't work. Oh, you can also just jump on these. Man, this boss. This boss. Ah, that's actually not too bad. I'm just being a big baby. Cool music, though. <laughs> I'll just hit you a hundred times. I have your land. I lost my horns for some reason. Well, I'm taking this. I'm so pissed, says the princess. I'm out of here. Here's a giant bomb! And Wario escapes with the lamp. And inside is a statue of Peach for some reason. Which. Oh, I see, it's a gold statue of Peach. It's the real treasure, which of course. <laughs> That dickweed Mario steals in his helicopter, but for some reason he never uses to actually rescue the princess. I don't know if you, I've, about you, but if I was Mario, I would totally be using the shit out of that helicopter <laughs> to rescue the princess every time. Oh well. Whatevs, Mario says. I still have a genie lamp. I can just wish for a million giant golden princess statues. So, I guess... Uh, I have no idea what that final boss was. Like, I know it's a genie, but who was the chick? Was it, like, Princess of Syrup Castle? I guess it could have been Queen. She didn't have a crown, which is why I'm saying Princess. Oh, he only gets one wish. I wish for... Castle. Ah, I seem to remember. Ah, that's right. You need to pay. No problem, Wario says. I have one million treasures. That's what this is for, I remember. So it adds the... Three... Three hundred coins? Where did I get three hundred coins from? Well, whatever. Oh, this is gonna take a long time. Oh, no, it's not. Why are they coming out in such a random order? Well, I'm gonna sit back and enjoy my non-brand fizzy substance drink while this goes on. Yeah, this is by far the most interesting part of the video. Um, yeah, let's use this time to, to get to know each other. So, what's your name? Oh, really? Okay. Well, that's good. I'm glad that we took this time to get to know each other. Um, yeah, I don't really have that much to talk about, to be honest. Uh, oh, I just noticed that one of my posters has fallen off my wall. What was that a poster of? It was a game map, but I can't remember which one it was. Probably EverQuest 2, if I had to guess? Or maybe not, maybe Grand Theft Auto. I can't remember. Um. Yeah. Ooh, I have a fun game. Since, you know, I just compared EverQuest 2 with Grand Theft Auto, leave a comment saying what your favourite genre video game is. Not your favourite game, don't care about that. Everyone has... well, I mean, everyone will have a different opinion on genre as well, but still. Favourite genre, go! Mine would be... 
If you asked me back when games like this came out, my favourite games would definitely be platformers. Love the hell out of them. Sonic, Mario, uh, Chuck Rock, Cool Spot, Quack Shot, Rolo. That's why most of my Let's Plays are platformers, just because they are the most fun to pick up and play and then put down again and forget about. Nowadays, I don't know. FPSs have a special place in my heart after Half-Life 2. RPGs are always, well, RPGs are sometimes fun. Good RPGs are awesome, but so many RPGs are terrible. But it's kind of hard to say that's my favourite genre. I don't know, I guess FPS, or just action games in general. Third person platformers, ha <laughs> there we go. Platformers all the way, there you go. So, I have nine, what's that, 93,500 gold. So, would that be enough for the genie? Um. Okay, so now I've got two big bags of gold. Yeah, I remember, if you, if you didn't get any of the treasures, you get like a crappy little hovel, and if you get all of them, I hope, you get a giant castle. That's what I'm hoping for. Obviously I can't go back and show you the other endings because I got all of the treasures on the first playthrough, so never mind. I'm sure there's a YouTube video there somewhere. There you go. Five gigantic bags of cashola. That should be enough, surely. Whoop, 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 whoop. All five. There you go. God knows why a genie needs cash to cast magic, but there we go. I like to think he's actually just a genie of time. He can speed up the time it takes to hire all the people, get them to acquire all the materials and build the castle. He's just a time skip genie. There you go, I got a freaking awesome palace. <laughs> With a W on it. It's like the one from, um, it's like the one Mario takes back in Six Golden Coins. That's awesome. Good job, Wario. Well, Mario appears happy with that. Oh, some gritty text there. Wario Land star. Yeah, so that's it. We've beaten Wario Land and it only took me about a year. Jesus Christ. And I think this is the 20th part, so that's a nice even number. Um, what's next on the old agenda? I'm leaving Dynamite Heady until I get back to the States, since for the same reason that I left Wario until I was back in the UK. Um, I might do a few Flash games. I've had a few Flash games queued up that I kind of... I want to play, but I want to record, because they seem like really good ones to record. Um, there's one called Depict. Since I've already recorded that, I might as well spoil that and say that I'm going to be uploading that now that this one's done. Um, yeah, there's a few others on Newgrounds. If you guys have any more suggestions for games, then please let me know, because I'm now in the position where I don't have anything else lined up immediately. Um, yeah. Good job, Yoshi Tommy Ryoji. It's good music, I like it. And Ishikawa Kozue. Kozue! Any of you guys know any Japanese people? Are any of you guys Japanese? I don't know why you'd be watching me if you were Japanese, since there are a million Japanese LPs that do a much better job and probably play much more interesting games, but, you know can't account for taste. Oh yeah, special thanks to Izushi Takehiro. He is the best guy. And Yamamoto Masao. Like, couldn't do this game without them and Harada Takahiro, of course. He did that. He was the T-boy. Oza Ozaki Nobuhiro, he was also the T-boy. Dan Alson, he was the American T-boy. He got the Americanos. Dave Brooks, he was the Russian tea guy. He got the whiskey and the vodka ones. Tamura Keiko, he was the mail room clerk. Mary Kokoma, she owned the bakery down the street where they went to lunch. Hiro Yamada, that was the bakery's owner's dad. David Patton, he was their lawyer when Mario tried to sue them. Graham Archer, he was their archer. Shibata Satoru, he was... I don't know, I wasn't there, I don't know what he did. Oh, I thought that, that was going to be the end, but obviously now we've got the <laughs> one testing player. You can't, no, you can't have more. You said testing player, you said one. Mm, I 
I don't like all... What the hell is that name? Sakashita Nas... 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 And Fukui Kota. I'm so racist. This all just reminds me of Pokemon. I guess because it's just the only place where I ever see these kinds of names written down nowadays. Since nowadays, not every single game is actually made by Japan. Unlike, you know, in the 90s. Where even if they were made in America or Europe, the cast would still be just full of Japanese names. Because that's probably where most of the actual programming and stuff took place. Like Imoto Takashi, I swear I've seen his name in so many game credits. Ah, oh, come on, Wario. Isn't your film getting tired by now? I think we can... No, something might happen after the cast, and surely it can't go on much longer. Wait, so who the hell... Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, story-wise, what were all these duck pirates about? Because he didn't fight a duck pirate king at all. Like, she had one duck knight, by the look of it. When its visor opened, it looked like there was a duck in there. But then, she was like, just a human woman. Well, I have no idea. Oh, producer. Yokoi Gompe. My favourite producer of all time. Oh, and presented by... Nina Pendo. A hundred year old company that started off by producing crappy action figures and plastic bits of nothing. Then they made Wario, and it was all downhill from there. Right, well, I guess that is the end. Can I skip? No. Is Wario doomed to. Oh! Ooh! Is that not the best castle? I'm honestly surprised if that's not the best castle, but it does say please retry. Well, maybe we'll get another little video of this, um, just showing you the best castle, really. Uh, or maybe not, because that would be quite a boring, like, one minute video, and there's no way I'm showing you guys the cast again. So, um, yeah, that's about it, so thanks for watching. My name is Fungus Trooper, and you've been watching the end of Let's Play Super Mario Land 3, Super Wario Land. Um, yeah, any comments or suggestions on games to play or just my methods and stuff, just leave a comment or send me a private message. Or if you can figure it out on YouTube's new horrible layout, leave a comment on my page. I read all of them. So, yeah, thanks a lot and see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Thumbs up! Wahaa!